Hello everyone, I'm Hopeful Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Hearts of Iron 4, Old World Blues, playing as Hopeville. So, this isn't exactly where we left off yesterday, it's pretty much the same place, but I just spent a little bit of time getting through the, or starting the oh, Rangers of the Move focus, but really to finish off some research here. So, uh, I'm still having my soldiers get to the front line against New Vegas, because that is a group that we are fighting next. Cool. Ooh, Tommy guns. That sounds like fun. Uh, right now, though... We only have two research slots. And I'm thinking, you know what? We love our couriers. We love our wasteland tactics, asymmetric warfare, land doctrine. Eventually, we do maybe want to speed things up. Let's go ahead and do some specialized warfare, perhaps? What am I trying to get at? I'm not really sure. Artisanal guilds? Oh, artisan guilds? Metalworking? Ooh, do we need? What do we need? I mean, our supplies are doing very well. Obviously, we're going to need manpower in the future. So, we'll grab some plant cultivation. That's probably not the best thing we could get, but whatever. Um, they don't actually have that many robots for being New Vegas. I do want to go to war with these guys, though. Which, we are probably going to struggle against these guys as well, just like what we did with the Mojave chapter. So, however, I should start planning I'll, to get a ton of political power because we're going to need to core a lot of places. Now, someone left in the comments that they can't really see this campaign for going on for too long. Totally, totally understand. I'm not sure how long this campaign is going to actually be, so... I have no idea. But we'll see how far it gets. Um, someone also mentioned from yesterday's comments, I should continue to do uh, looting or scavenging armories, missile silos, to see what we can get from those places, such as maybe power armor or something else. We will hopefully get through that today. Hopefully. We can go to war with the Phoenix Republic or the SSR, the Shady Sands Republic, but right now, the Shady Sands Republic isn't looking super good. So, probably not them. We'll probably go against the Phoenix Republic. We got another division here. Awesome! Uh, three divisions is pretty good. Hopefully, Rangers. I prefer our Spec Ops divisions. Honestly, those are quite a bit better. No, let's not do that one. We're going to do that. Can we just use you and convert? Nope. You would be over Special Forces. That's okay. So our guys are almost all there anyways. And let's just see what happens if we go to war. Are they Oh, you're allied with the Boomers, which isn't good. They got a lot of manpower, but we'll see what happens. Uh, retake core state. Cool. They do not instantly fight us, which is fine, because I... Can I get rid of these guys here? I might be able to. Yeah, I might be able to. You know what I'm thinking? We eventually want to get planes, perhaps. That might be a very, very good thing to do, and I would love to kill these guys off before the boomers come down here and interfere. Can I... I can pierce them, but we just can't do any damage to them. How disappointing. You guys can probably help out as well. See what you can do. Just like with the Mojave chapter, we're going to try to get these guys out of there. Get these infantry divisions out of there first. Or that infantry division that she was annexed. I should really focus on more special forces. Ooh, that is not looking good because you guys stopped attacking. Two, three. Now there's only two divisions. Good. Ooh, they threw in another one. Now it's only infantry. Yeah, trying to get this place and kill them off. Not easy. And they didn't like that, which makes sense. Go ahead and get rid of these guys. Go ahead, and you come up here. Defend. Everyone's going to have to defend first. Good. And we can pierce them. So we get a song from the front. Let's get some more war support. That seems like a pretty good idea. Oh, Allison Kemper. Do you have anything for us? No, you're level 5, which is very awesome. And uh, those divisions are dead. Great. I'm going to throw you right here because we need support immediately. we got some wasteland knowledge. Great. And we're going to grab leg infantry recovery rate. It goes up as well as recon. That sounds amazing. And you, you two to come over here. Special forces are dying. And we could really use more defense right there. Come on, get in there before our manpower is just completely obliterated. Cool, we've lost 300 guys, which is quite a bit, but they've lost more than double so far. Which is a very good thing. Actually, we're fighting the boomers as well. Yeah, they got a lot of divisions, which isn't good. Maybe I should really research tanks. I should probably research tanks. We might be able to pierce into here, maybe. Rangers always on the move, we get more speed. Phoenix Republic gets Master's Remnants, awesome. Let's see, what can I do here? You know what? What if we build up infrastructure? In the most optimal places first, and then build that stuff up. Cool. Uh, 
pretty good, pretty good. Glowing hills, sure, why not? Can't build radar, which is fine. Um, yeah, really much. That's pretty much it. Now I could probably bait them into attacking me. Let's remove three divisions. Maybe that'd be enough. See what happens there? No. Okay, well, whatever. If I have to, at have to attack, I'm going to attack with somebody special. Hmm. Ooh. Al oh, Alison, do yourself. Oh, Urban Assault. Yeah, sure, why not? That sounds like a good idea. Alright, robots. Are you not going to attack me at all? Come on, man. Come on. Oh, yes. We can make a better Spec Ops Division now. Can I make you a better Spec Ops Division? Nice. Very nice. That's awesome. Ranger's always on the move. Very good. We do need more attacks. So I'm going to continue going down this way first. Capacity and multipliers are nice. Special forces attack. I like that. Ranger's leading the way. It's not bad. Expand the Ranger Corps. Everyone who has agreed that the Ranger Corps has great potential to be the most effective force in our nation. As such, expanding its size will ensure a large force of capable soldiers. We're going to do that, and then I've got another idea where we're going to go next. We're specifically, over the left side, and get to repair the transports. We get free planes, basically. Free blueprints for planes, because we're definitely going to need that. Now, can I break into here? That is a very good question. I doubt I can. We do have a lot of divisions here, but we'll see what happens. Add support on there. Planes will be the bread and butter of how we will win, but we're actually doing fairly okay. It looks like the boomers don't really care about helping their ally, which is a great thing for us. A tremendous thing for us. Good. Slowly but surely, we will get there. There's a couple divisions here that we need to beat up. And before we do anything else, occupy territories. Pacification, pacification. Awesome, awesome. Of course, as much territory as we possibly can eventually. Uh, get all but you, all but you. Come that way. I could do supported attacks, but nah. If that's the case, is this... That's... Oh. We might be able to just launch ourselves. Right there. That'd be good. And you are just kind of... Supporting the attack, which is good. Get up to New Vegas. Maybe you could be able to capitulate them, too. Uh, go and help out here, too. Losses, 356 versus 742. And... Good. We're immediately defending. And we would like to immediately attack New Vegas, which is not going very well. That's okay. Allison, you have a new, new upgrade? Level 5? No, but you're loading quite a bit, which I love. I think we might attack here next. Maybe. We'll see what happens. Good. Six divisions? Sure. 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 And actually, I want you guys to go right there. Go straight up that way. We might be able to take attack Jacob's Ten, Jacob's Town, which would be amazing. Great. Awesome. Now they might attack us crazily, but I kind of doubt it. If we can get that tile, our, our literal core, that'd be great. I do want to wait to get that plain stuff. Specialized Warfare seems like a pretty good idea to do right now. Good. Oh, they have some power armor. Okay, cool, cool. I'm going to try to resist using too much power armor in this campaign. Just because, you know, I love it, but I'm going to try to emphasize Special Forces. Ooh, and they're attacking us like crazy. With 17 divisions. We can't pierce them, which sucks, but they can't quite win there. We are going to be suffering a lot of casualties, probably. That's okay, send half you guys up here, and then send you guys right there. Nice. Those extra divisions definitely helped. How much manpower do these guys have, actually? Not a lot, which is a good thing. You know what? If they want to do that, then you know what? I'll go beat them back then. Jacob's son is cut off. Great. Then we'll attack here next because they're being distracted and they're actually running out of supplies, which is awesome. You know what? Send another division up there. Expand the Ranger Corps. Great. Let's do start building a new life. With our fledgling settlement now stable, it is time for us to begin building a new life for ourselves. Hopeville is in tatters and it take, will take literal years to resort to an even passable settlement. However, we have to start somewhere. To build, build, build. Excuse me for one second here. My apologies, I thought I heard my cat outside my door. 
No, we want to make sure that we can keep funneling soldiers into here because, well, we don't want to lose this tile. That's not cool. Losing tiles isn't a good thing. Even though we are losing some manpower, but that's why we put chemical companies on these guys. You can keep attacking. You're not going to win here, son. You ain't going to win. Broken coast. Very cool. Nice. They try to attack. I want to let these guys starve for supplies first. How many? They're attacking with literally 23 divisions. That's a lot of guys. That's a lot of guys. And I'm surprised they're not taking any sort of attrition from here. That's, that's interesting. Alright, alright. You know what? One guy comes out. Alright, we'll put another guy in. Another com guy comes out. We're going to put another few of them in there. I can't wait to see the casualties for the boomers because they are going to be suffering a lot. Just like these guys. And this just gives us time to pacify the area more and more and more. Actually, what about right here? What do they have? Boulder City. Boulder City. How much would it take? 180? Good. The Fall of New Canaan? Great. Great, great, great. You can keep trying, guys, but it isn't going to work. You've put in 24 divisions now. Surprise, New Vegas isn't trying to attack any part of my line, which I'm a little stuck, of course. Voice that intuition. Now we get more recovery rate for our, for our infantry and recon, which is only going to help us. We can put even more infantry in our divisions, which would be great. Oh boy, oh boy, we can kind of figure out what you're doing, son. We might consider even raising our ability of our anti-tank. I mean, I must be killing a lot of them off. But yeah, look at that. Now, we've lost 700 guys so far, but it is what it is. Tahama creatures? I've never heard of Tahama creatures before. Cool, cool. What can we else can we do here? Nice, very nice. We can build more stuff, resource efficiency gain, I like that stuff, but, hmm. Infrastructure, APCs. APCs, I always like APCs. Chief of the Air Force. I mean, we can keep doing this, that'd be kind of fine with me. No training time, more organization. Let's, let's flop over there. And we can start building a new life for us. Great. Rebuild the Hopeville Early Warning Systems. Scattered across Hopeville National, the state-of-the-art radar and anti-air systems intended to defend against a Chinese air attack or worse. Although many are damaged beyond repair, it'll be possible to repair some of the systems, namely the short-range radar installation within Hopeville, as well as several anti-air cannons. Very good. Oh, and we have specialized warfare as well. Can I grab any more anti-tank? I think that would be great. 185 days. That's just a little bit too much for me. Specialized warfare. We could go with power armor, but like I said, I really want to emphasize special forces in this campaign, so... Platoon organization. Eh, we'll grab Ranger Endurance Training. Sure, why not? Even though this doesn't help our infantry currently, that's okay. I wonder, can I just win here if I just push these guys this way? Uh, how much? Oh wow, they're really trying to nail these guys so hard now. All right, help them out some more. Boomers, you've lost too many guys. Actually, actually, did they push me back? Oh, no, you did not. You did not just do that. Actually. Could you do that instead? Cut these guys off? Yes. Maybe yes. You're going to defend the last guy right now? Yes. Yes, very much yes. Great. Oh, part of the plan, my friend. Part of the plan. Kill these guys off. They're annoying. They get no supply. Well, they get very little supply. Good. Kill these guys off, too. We can spread out the line here, which makes it uh, stronger for everyone. Great. They all died there. I love it. And they died all here, too. Look at that. We might have lost a 1,000 guys, but they've lost over 3,000 now. Four, basically 4,000 in total. I think that's great. I think that's really, really great. If that's the case... Oh, New Vegas, you have chosen poorly. I might lose it, you know, a tile here or there, but, you know, whatever. That's okay with me. Oh, not everyone. Not everyone, man. They're attacking with a lot of guys, though. Tons and tons. Oh, they're actually attacking my special forces, too. Good. Good. I wonder if we can take New Vegas yet. 
Uh, guys, I want you attacking Vegas. Can you... Not... You can't get there, huh? Cool. If that's the case, you're gonna stop attacking. And you can move over there. Ridgers, cool. They're actually beating us back. Holy crap. How? They're not that strong. These guys are really not that strong. Nine divisions? Yeah, I don't think so, son. Okay, beat them up over here. Help them out. Kill those divisions off. Yeah, I... The boomers? Mmm, boomers. Uh, yeah, I don't think so, son. I don't think so. Cascadia? Cool. I mean, you can keep attacking. And you can figure out what's going to happen to you, but... It isn't going to end well for you, my friend. Yeah, we've lost a lot of guys out of this stupid war. A lot of stupid wars. Because enemies are... Well, stupid. Good. Look at that. Beautiful. And they're panicking. As they rightfully should. I did not know this tile is not connected to New Vegas. Rebuilding the waste. Very cool. Very cool. Let's get another division in. And, oh, another two divisions, perhaps. Led by... Norton Randall. Strong attack, Kemmerlite. God dang it, why do you have to use Kems, man? That ain't good for you. Uh, rooted. Let's come up here. Thank you, my friend. Now we're definitely boarding the Boomers. And they are just kind of suiciding into my lines. Could be worse. Oh, man, we definitely need more manpower now. Ugh, disgusting. Do I not... Oh, I can't core that yet. Okay, makes sense. Wait, can I not core... Oh, I can't core that because we don't have enough... Uh, thingy with it. Where was that? Hold on. Right there? Well, you're at 100%, so just do that. Cool. You guys seem a little suicidal, but you know what? I guess you guys do you guys. We're gonna attack this area now. Because I'd like to capitulate these guys, and then focus on the boomers solely. Great! Scavenge Ashen Airbase. Hidden within the mountains of Ashen is a small airbase that has managed to stay relatively untouched by prospectors. Our engineers, though, believe that several of the pre-war plans could be operational. Or at least made operational. Let's go ahead and cut down on some of this, just because it's costing us quite a bit. We only have a core population of 116,000, and New Vegas is gone. Thank you, New Vegas. You deserve nothing. But hey, maybe we'll get some more... Look at that manpower. Yes, we got a cores on it. Yes. And the boomers, we have chosen poorly. Incredibly poorly. Great. Attack and defense core territory. That actually might be okay. Smooth talker. Just get recovery rate. I like that the one the most, probably. Or one of the most. Level 4, 6, 3, 1. Awesome. Te technologically, we are doing okay. We have the gang. Oh, what the hell? What? Boomers, just for that, I'm going to make sure you don't live. Yeah. You want to take my territory? I take yours right back. Or, just t take yours. Whatever. I can't speak. Words are hard. Boulder City, thank you. Thank you, Boulder City. Good. Now, hopefully they keep attacking here, because we're going to get that Air Force base, whether they like it or not. Hmm. Actually, that's not a bad idea. I don't know if that's connected to Bitter Springs. We've lost 774 versus 3,000. I can't imagine the Boomers continually being able to get more... Ma yeah. Yep. Especially since some of this is cord, some of this is probably not cord. Yeah. They need manpower for resistance stuff. And unfortunately, they're out. Good. Oh, well, let me make sense that we move this way as well, then. Take half, you guys. You guys come there as well and help out. Make sure you put holes in their guys' heads. Escape slave from the Dam Busters. Freedom is the right of every Wastelander, son, don't you know? So they probably won't go to war with us, but... If I could get the Dam Busters... That territory? That'd be real nice. 29... Almost 30,000 people there? That's pretty nice. I'm gonna attack here next. Once these guys move over. We have taken Vault 22, my friends. Very good. Alright, this is gonna be a slaughter. Good. 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 And you know what? You guys, you immediately push that way into the airbase. Ah, the gang's all here, my friends. Less combat with. Let us get more breakthrough for the army. Just flat out more breakthrough. Great. Immediately start attacking him this way. Ooh, can we help attack? Yes, we can. 
What? You don't want to lose? What? We still can't pierce them, which is a little crazy. Oh, hold on. Maybe I spoke a little too soon, but maybe not. Good. What? Boomers? What? You made decisions that's going to hurt you in the long run? What? What? Let's ask for that. Cool. 66 more people a month. Pfft. Followers. I am not lowering my conscription level. Are you kidding me? Do you not see that we're in a state of basically total courier war? At Ranger Endurance Training? Great. Get some more Rangers. I'd love to have APCs. I feel extremely limited, though, with only two research slots. It's 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 extremely limiting. Holy cow. Let's get some of that, I suppose. Why not? Avenger the Ashton Air Base. Repair the transports. Within the Ashton Airfield are two dozen pre-war transfer planes. If we were to able or if we were to invest in restoring these aerial behemoths, we would be capable of having a small fleet of transport planes for courier services. I love it. I love it, my friends. Oh yeah, we can't even pierce these guys, but you know what? We're going to continue to attack them. Good. Put them in their place. You can keep throwing men in there, but you've lost everyone. You've lost them all. Next up, we're going to attack with the air, but... Oh. Hope we can do well there. We should be able to. Should be able to. So we can circle three more enemy divisions. Hmm. I love it. Do not let any of them move. You don't even have to win, just don't let him move. Come on, guys, you have to win. Good, they're stopped moving, kind of. At least there's still two divisions down there. Come on, come on. They have no organization. Come on, just kick them out. Oh, God, they're throwing in more power armor. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I swear to God, power. some of this power armor is way too strong. It's way too strong. And I refuse to use it because this is a career and special forces playthrough. Thank you. Cool. Don't let them rest up. You can get... We can get rid of these guys. I know we can. The game just doesn't want me to. So be it then. We will get that in sequence soon enough. Let's us spend some time. Let's enjoy ourselves. Let's see. Where else are we going to attack them? Nellis Air Force Base. You are a prime target. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. If you don't let us win and take Bitter Springs, then we'll just take your capital. Actually, how much do we have to use or get to capitulate these guys? That's a good question. Apparently, they don't really care about their base. Okay, well, whatever. Uh, all but one can attack there. If possible, we could just cut these guys off. I'm giving them force attack to attack as fast and kill them off as fast as possible to move. It's going to stretch out our lines quite a bit, but you know what? We're on defense now. We are on defense. Good. Especially if we got more infantry coming in. Oh, you don't like that? Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. I'm going this way instead. Keeping you there. Great. No. I bought myself enough time to go up that direction. Don't give me that crap. Good. Now, because of your insolence, we're going to just murder you here. Thank you, my friends. Thank you very much. All but one. Kill them off. You don't like that? Oh, no. Kill them off, kill them off. They have no supplies. How are you not winning here? Oh my goodness. You can't be getting like any supplies here. Maybe except from Bitter Springs, that's it. Ah, we've got some transports with free technology, thank god. Uh, repair stuff. Oh, more population. Oh, we could really use that. Rebuild Hopeville Industries. Hopeville was thankfully unscathed during the devastation of the Great War. But, two centuries of neglect has done its damage to the sparse civilian industries within Hopeville. But with enough work, we could should, we should be able to get some workshops operational once again. Ooh, yeah. That sounds like a good idea. Sounds like a very, very good idea. How are you not winning? I, I legit don't understand. Like, is this like mountains? I mean, maybe it's mountains? It's urban, which makes a little bit of sense, but still. Kill them off. Just. They can't get supply. They cannot get su They just couldn't get supply. And yet, they still won. Uh, we've lost way too many guys these guys. Basically, 1,200. Really, 1,300 by the time these guys are all dead and done. Too many guys. 
Good. Good. Now, we're not like the Legion, the former Legion. We're not going to crucify these people. We're just going to put a bullet in every single one of their heads and finish them off like this. Ah, oh, very nice. So, the Boomers, you had a chance. 5,000 losses, not bad. Anyone have upgrades? Very good. Oh, they like attacking me. Good. Somehow they were doing really well against us, though, but you know, whatever. Whatever. Good. Now, we could do a general attack, but since manpower is so precious in this game, it's, I'm not going to do that. Get some migrants. I want to stick our necks up that far. Because I don't know if we can make an encirclement over here, maybe, or an encirclement over here, maybe. I really don't know. We'll see what happens, though. Ah, oh, crop rotation is very good. More monthly population, perhaps. It's not very much, but hey, you never know. You never know. Good. Now, where does that leave us? We're going to attack right here. Send happy guys. Attack right there. With the special forces, we should be doing great. Great. And circle these two guys. Oh, okay. You just abandon your post? Yeah. That's going to work out real well for you, man. Real well. We killed him off. Makes it even easier for us. Let's realign the front line real quick, just a little bit. And see what we can do with these guys. Can I perhaps core anything else? Do I need to core anything else? Actually, that's a good question to ask. Uh, overall, the Mojave is doing really, really well. Some areas, of course, could do better than others, but, you know, whatever. Cool. You know what? I hate you, Power Armor. I hate enemy Power Armor so much. So, we're going to do that. You guys are going to come up there. And then try to get that way. Half of you guys are going to come here. And the one of you guys are going to come that way. Two of you guys are going to come that way. And you guys are going to come up that way too. Great. Let's go ahead and grab this. Night Stalker Tactics. More recovery rate, less out of supply, and resistance growth speed in our states occupied by the enemy. Even though that last thing really won't matter too much. Good. Good. We kill him off. You are not moving. You son of a bitch. You are not moving, son. You're giving me too much headache for this. You're going to die here like the dogs you are. And they died. And they rightfully died. Now, like I said, manpower is precious. So, um... Okay, AI. You're really running out of divisions, aren't you? And... There you go. I'm suggesting that you all don't move that way. I guess we could use you guys to help support attack that direction. That'd be fine. Cool. Next up, there, the rabble. I'd like to get that down there, but I did say I was going to do a little bit more of this. Let us scavenge the Ashton missile silo. Deep within Ashton lies a single unopened missile silo that, if opened, could contain countless pre-war artifacts that is, if we are able to deal with the robots that are guarding the silo's internals. Good. Good. They're dead. As they should be. Now, let's just go ahead and do this. Yeah, this is what you deserve, boomers. Well, boomers in game, 7,000 losses. For us suffering 1,300 casualties just from these guys alone. Mm. But I'm glad we were able to core New Vegas. That really helped us out quite a bit. And hopefully, we can start coring some of this area too. Great. That took quite a while to do, my friends. Quite a while. Now, who do we attack next? I'm going to say the Sorrows just because. Or oh, actually, the Scorpions. Scorpions are. Yeah. They're looking pretty weak. That could eventually put us in a bad position with Shady Sands Republic. They do have... Ooh, they have a lot of people joined with them. Which I don't think we'd be really, really ready in a war for. But we could take their stuff. They have the NCR, or what might become the NCR, doesn't really have that many claims. Do they Do they get claims? Shady in Crisis. Settle with the Scorpions. Race for the Hill. The Diplomat. Ooh, I don't know. We could get into a really bad war against these guys. Hmm. If I take the Scorpions out. It might be better if I just expand into Utah instead. Tar Walkers. You're looking pretty large. Not gonna lie. How strong are the Tar Walkers? Thousand manpower. Not a lot of divisions. What about the Sorrows? Take them out. Maybe core their lands. They're not that strong. I like Area 6. Desert Rangers faction-wise, though... They have the NCR, you have the Southern League, NCR, Northern League, Children of the Gate. The Phoenix Republic is struggling. Twisted Hairs might be good to take out. Oh, we want to take out these guys first. Damn busters. Let's do that first. 
And I'm going to do this tactic where I'm just going to pull these guys out first. Let's get a new leader. Uh, Evander. Oh, wait. I didn't need to do that. Oh, whatever. Horus. You. Looking pretty good. Get some more attack. So, I'm going to let them come into my lands a little bit first, actually. Uh, just so that we can spread out their divisions a little bit more. They can come out, and then we can probably concentrate forces a little bit more easily. Uh, I'm going to put you guys, like, over here or something. Cool. Investigate rumors. We could do that. Or I could save my political power up a little bit more. Mojave chapter. Good. What parts of the Mojave chapter? Route 95. It's not worth much, but you know what? I'd rather not have resistance down there. Cool, so we'll let them in these two provinces. Or is it just... Yeah, these two provinces. So this way, the, their 11 divisions become weaker, which would be very nice. And we can just go straight to Hoover Dam. Especially using our... Special Forces Divisions. Oh, gosh. Evander. Well, this doesn't apply if you do, uh, generals of things. So, as our forces advance down the quiet hallways of the Astro Missile Silo, they turn the corner to discover the facility's entire automated security force deactivated in the recharging stations. And after giving our uh, engineers several says to program, hmm, we have successfully hacked these protectrons to serve us. Cool, we get robots to serve us. Cool. What about... The Ashton Armory. With the Ashton Missile Silo looted and located, we have discovered a large armory deep within the confines of the silo that appears to have not been open for centuries, although it will take months to gain access. The possibility of pre-war weaponry is simply too worthwhile to pass up. Absolutely. Absolutely. That has a lot of resources that we could use. Actually, how, how much do you guys got here? If I could look at it... Guys, I don't care about my arm... I, don't care about my army that much. Please, let me just click on a tile. Can I not see them? Yeah, I don't care about looking at my army that much game. Uh, how much further do we have until we can do that? I might... If we do this, we might go to War of the Twisted Hairs as well. That seems like a good idea. 12, 18, that's not bad. For us, currently, we currently have 35 days left, which isn't bad. Confederacy of Dayglow. That's cool. Irrigation. Awesome. Grab some of that. Construction speed. Output. Output is already pretty darn good. I know I shouldn't wait for that, but I'm going to get some triplane attackers. That's going to be so useful for us. So useful. Vehicle designers. I would... Oh, look at that. After weeks of reading maps and searching, we have successfully discovered the location to an off-site armory that has apparently been filled to the brim with weaponry, waiting to be transported to the Sierra Army Depot shortly before the Great War. After careful, carefully dealing with facilities, security systems, and fail-safes, we have successfully gained access to the bunker's armory, which, as we believed, is filled with pre-war weaponry. Advanced weaponry. Cool. If I could choose one. Yeah. Hmm. Cool, not bad. We could probably loot the Hopeville... Loading Station. The Hopeville Loading Station has been off-limits to our populace due to pre-war military robots roaming the area, firing on sight at anything that moves. However, the time has come for us to deal with these foes and secure whatever lies within the Loading Station. Cool, I just wanted to see what that other thing said. Empire of the Mojave is looking pretty sweet, though. Looking pretty darn sweet. Even the Shady Sands Republic is coming back. How strong are you guys? You are part of the NCR. You only have so many divisions. You have a lot of manpower. The Scorpions are out of manpower with a few more divisions. As long as you're killing each other off, that is the best thing for us. And you guys can probably stop training now. Get some more organization. Well, the divisions that need it. Good. Urban assault. Oh, almost becoming an urban assault specialist. Good. Very good. Yeah, output. Really nice. Really, really nice. Right now, though, maybe we get some planes in the air? Especially for these guys, I think that'd be great. I can build convoys at least. Let's make some of those bad boys. Transport gliders, eh, those are okay. We're building up a lot of infrastructure, which is great. We can go to war with Hoover Dam. Let them come in. If I could click on these guys, I totally would go to war. How do I get to them? 
I'm so far away from Hoover Dam with my mouse, I can't click on them. I'm still clicking on my divisions. What the heck, game? Son. I'm in the river. No. Dam? Give me the dam! Hmm. How can I... Where, where's that uh, diplomacy screen? Thank God we still got the diplomacy screen. Thank God for that. Oof. Wait, hold on. Um... Can... Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, sure. Oh, oh, thank God we have this. Damn busters. Woo! Good, let them move in. Great! Now they have... Weaker divisions. Or... Weak... Less strength on those guys. Which is a good thing. We're gonna attack from... Wait, is... Boulder City our cap? Oh, no. Hmm. Cool. We're gonna straight attack there and then move in there, perhaps. You guys can move in as well. Help support the attack. Great! So, as our prospectors slowly but effectively dealt with the security bots surrounding the Hope Belt loading station, it became very clear that the station has been looted years ago, and very little remains for our prospectors. But, they're brought home with what they could. Just a couple guns. Loot the Hope Belt missile silo. With the loading bay picked clean, we are now drawing upon plans to open the blast doors of Hope Belt's missile silo and scavenge anything that may be inside. However, though, we can hear those robotic beasts from within. It will be a pitched battle no matter what. Cool, we won. As we should. Immediately start attacking that way. Immediately start attacking that way. Because this doesn't matter here. What we really need is this over here. Hmm. Maybe this battle plan isn't... Oh, well, we can do that. That actually makes a lot more sense. Cool. There you go. That's how we're going to do it. Great. Just cut him off. Losses, 131. Yeah, definitely not as good as robots, but whatever. Don't let them come in after we start killing them. No, no, no. Come on. Do not let them in. Do not let them in. Do not let them in. No, no. I said don't let them in. <laughs> ah. Ooh, they're having troubles. Nice, and that's how you do it. Great job, guys. Hoover, hmm. If we go to war with Twisted Hairs, that might put us at odds with the Phoenix Republic. Then again, they have a lot of divisions. They actually have a lot of divisions. Unlimited power. Oh no. The scorpions actually beat the Oh my gosh. This is the perfect opportunity for us to kill them off then. So what we're gonna do is go and do this. They're out of manpower, so that's great. Can I core any of this territory yet? No I cannot. Oh, let's get more space. Ah, oh, nice soccer tactics. Great. And we're going to do Cazador Venom. I hate Cazador so much. In Vegas, so much. Cool. I'll let you guys come down here. Uh, yeah, that'd be fine. I'm going to have you guys come right there. And I'm going to have you guys come right here. I'll probably just make, make another Spec Ops Division. That'd probably be pretty darn good. Building New Life is gone, so we build a little bit slower now, but you know, whatever. Whatever, my friends, that'll be fine. So, the prospector slowly and carefully descended into the maze of hallways that is the Hopeville Missile Silo and began quietly scavenging for anything of value as the silo's automated security continued to lurk every corner, but this silence was broken. By small arms fire as several of our scavengers were sighted by the security or sentry bots, causing countless of our scavengers to lose their lives in the process. However, as the last sentry bot was deactivated, our scavengers did find a small arsenal in the silo's barracks. Oh god, we lost manpower, that's not good. And let us breach the Hopeville Armory. With the Hopeville Missile Silo picked clean, all that is left for us to scavenge in Hopeville is the Hopeville Armory, which our prospectors believe its contents are still in touch after the start of the war. Right, and before we keep doing that, let's make sure we, everyone here who needs training gets the training that they need. Good, good, good. Yeah, this, this, is, this isn't enough. I can't wait to get some triplane attackers. We're doing really well with building industry. Resource-wise, we are doing amazingly, especially once we take the damn busters. Mm, love it. Good rates conscription. No, actually, I can't. But you know what? Now we can. That actually might be a good thing to do right now. Since we're peace. Or I could do this. Military academy training. Faster justify war goals times. More division organization. This is a bad idea to do right now since I want to core more states. But we're going to do it anyways because I can. 
But like I said before, I'm not really sure how far we're going to get in this campaign. Um, we already have most of the Mojave, if not all the Mojave, under us. Uh, oh, well, most of it. Great, so, as our prospectors recovered from the catastrophe of the Hopeville Missile Silo Expedition, they once again began scavenging the lower levels of the armory, which thankfully was devoid of any pre-war defense systems as the power had gone out long ago. The scavengers continued down, down the dark and eerie hallways until reaching what appeared to be an armory. After spending several days restoring power and hacking its security mechanisms, the door opened up, revealing a massive armory of pre-war weaponry ripe for the taking. Scavenge power armor, how great. How great. Hmm... Special Forces Attack? I like that. Actually, what happens over here? Military Journals. Population? Uh, eh, whatever. We could do that, but... We must well do this one first. So, scattered across Hopevale and Ashton are dozens of pre-war journals made by soldiers deployed within the respective towns. But, if we were able to decipher these journals, a large amount of useful battle tactics could be gained and utilized. Absolutely. Uh, I need to save my political power up now. Yeah, definitely need to save it up. And get some Triplane Detectors and finish off our land auction quickly. Because after this, we'll get some Death Claw Ferocity, which gives us more Breakthrough, Heart Attack, and even more Special Forces Capacity, which I love. I love it so much. Cool. Oh, you guys are done. Yeah, you still need to train. Actually, do you have enough ability already or skill? Not really. I mean, he's strong. He's, he's rooted, which is good. You guys are Urban Assault Experts, Expert Hell Fighters. Awesome stuff. Uh, Horus, still kind of green, still green a little bit, yep, uh, pretty green. Great, triplane attackers, I love it. Yeah, let's at least use those guys, Tommy Guns. Research speed. We could get more encryption, more decryption, more good stuff like that. But before we end today's video, I do want to go to war with the Scorpions, because they are looking pretty darn weak. Go ahead and stop training, my friends. You will be probably more than fine up north dealing with... This group. Uh, you, could, you guys should actually be okay as well. Cool. Another, another division. After them. Yeah, we're gonna go over the twisted hairs. That's fine. Cool. Let's go ahead and go to war. See how long it's gonna take us to kill them off. It shouldn't take us that long since they're already out of manpower. So, but I could be wrong. I could be very, very much wrong. Great. Uh. Sure, New Reno, if you really want access, that's fine. Let's see, we've lost 15 guys. That's quite a bit. They've lost 1,000. Okay, they've lost... How did they lose that much already to us? That's that's a 1,700 now. Holy cow. I really don't even have to do very much here since they're so weak already. It doesn't even matter. I hope the other California sections don't come killing us or asking for this territory back. I really hope that they don't. But you never know. Go ahead and start killing them there, too. Good. If anything, wow, you are really weak now. How many men have we lost? Six? It must be supply-wise, then. It must be supply. It's gotta be supply. Just gonna cut, casually cut these guys off, because there's no port down here. Great. Take Mojave base. Great. And we want you to serve. Every citizen of, Ho of Hopeville has a duty to serve their nation, and this belief has begun spreading rapidly throughout our lands. Already, our recruitment centers have been receiving dozens of new applicants. Good. Good. As we should be. Take Shady Sands. Good. Very nice. There's really not much that they can do to stop us. Barstow? Barstow? Guys, I would appreciate it if you did a little bit more than that, maybe. I would really appreciate it if you actually moved. Oh, this is definitely going to kill off a lot of uh, extra manpower, whatever we need to you know, make sure we have these guys under us properly. There you go. Um, just because they're not bored and climb with the new Reno, there's no way for them to get back here, so I'm just going to take everything we can first. Or... Liberate the shitty sins. We could get the NCR as a puppet. Now that sounds much more interesting. Hmm. I could probably always liberate them later. You know what? I think I want them as a puppet. Liberate the shitty central public. Yeah, let's try that. Well, we're not going to liberate. We're just going to satellite them. That sounds like a lot of fun. And maybe they can continue expanding later on. I like that. Let's try that. If 
if that isn't a good idea, you know, someone will let me know in the comments below. But we'll see what happens. Sorry everyone else, you didn't get stuff, but you know what? I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow as we continue expanding, and we'll judge how far this campaign shall go. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you have a great rest of your day. Leave a like if you liked the video, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, which I think I already said twice now. Whatever, have a great rest of your day.